How's it going? My name is Wolfie the Squirrel, and I am playing Notebook Detective. All right, October 29th, 1921. Hello, new detective. Hello. As we discussed at the office, you will be taking over this case. Here is the summary of what I told you. The victim was named William. Well, he's still named William, just because he's dead. It's still his name. So his name is Work, man. Uh, he was a 23-year-old black man. He was found in the alleyway next to the bar on the 25th of October and appears to have died from blunt force trauma to the head. That sucks. It seems like the culprit tried to make it look like a robbery due to a missing wallet and other valuables. Another note of interest. Uh, one of Williams' band members is currently on trial for another crime. Best of luck to you. Signed by... Raw. A. Maybe. I don't know what his name is. I'm just going to call him Dude. Alright, let's get into this. Ooh. This game looks pretty good. I like the rain. It sounds good, too. Um, should I go? Is this a door? Obviously, it's a freaking door. I hear someone talking. Where am I going? Oh, this is the alleyway outside the bar. Okay. Got to look for clues. Uh, I see a beer and stuff. Alright, hold on. I need to look at the controls real quick. Or not. There we go. Okay. There's no controls. Okay. So I just gotta figure this out myself. Okay, not a problem. Okay. Saying okay a lot. Okay, this is obviously locked because it's got a lock on it. I'm smart. Um, okay. Well, let's go down the steps, I suppose. Nope. Okay. So, either I am the worst video game player ever or completely stupid. Could be both. Not sure. I haven't figured that out yet. Um, how come I can't go in here? I want to go. E. <gasps> okay. It's a lot. Oh, okay. So I just picked up the lock for no reason. Cool. Not a problem. Thank you. Alright, here's some broken glass and a hat. Is the gasping really necessary? Oh, there's a thing there. No, I want... Okay. The notebook. You have obtained new information. This information is saved in the notebook tab. Press tab to open the notebook. Open the notebook to learn the basics. Okay. Tab. Notes of interest. Oh, that is freaking cool, Annabelle. So I got to, okay, so I'm going to take hat off. Can I do that? I can't, can I? Okay, a hat was found in the alleyway, a rather modern style. Annabelle is written in the rim. I wonder if I'm limited, so that's all the notes I can actually take. Uh, the victim was named William. He was a 23-year-old black man. He was found in the alleyway next to the bar. Blah, blah, blah. Already read that. Okay. Find an item or insert the right information to unlock the narrator. Works at the same company you do and was here before. Okay. So, okay, cool. But that doesn't necessarily mean, I mean, I guess it would mean that that's the person's name, or it could just be the distributor. Maybe that's the company. That's a nice hat, though. I like the hat. 
All right, let's uh, let's keep looking, shall we? Uh, see lots of broken glass. What's that? Oh, that's just the cork. That's just the plug. All right. Another Kalu investigator company. Oh, <laughs> okay. Give me the give me the booze. Does, it, does, does, does this mean something? Does this mean something? Is that the name of the bar? Huh? Wait, what? 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 That means nothing. Okay. I don't need you. I don't. Okay. Apparently, I do. New information. It's the. It's been common since the prohibition started for illegal booze makers to use ironic names for their brands. That's probably why this one says investigator company. Piece of, of evidence that you just found contains information about the first character. The investigator. The investigator. We can drag the job to your notes of interest page. Remember, you can grab any word and use it for your investigation. Okay, so can I replace? Okay, I can. Alright. So, Annabelle, investigator. That's what it's telling me. Annabelle unlocked. You have now unlocked Annabelle. This character will tell its tail when interacting with objects. Oh, that's cool. So if I... I reorganize the amount of bottles as a reminder for when I have to get inside again. Uh, okay, thank you. So let's go back to the hat. What do you got to say about the hat? I was putting number one in the padlock when this damn wind blew my hat straight into a puddle. I have to buy a new one now. I mean, it's perfectly fine. He could have just picked it back up, dried it off, I guess. Then again, what do I know? I don't know hats. Okay, let's keep going. Libby's cooked corned beef. Ooh, that sounds good. Corned beef? Heck yeah, man! Alright, I don't think... Someone's smoking. Most standard locks start at one of the higher numbers. In this case, eight, and then go downward. So, eight. I got it. I'm smart. Yeah. Scrawny Bob hit the clock right when I asked for the time. Defect. So Bob. Who's Bob? Who's Bob? Oh wait, what's this? Every time you interact with a new object, hold on. Every time you interact with a new interactable, an evidence page will be added to the notebook. These pages will contain information that the narrators will tell you along the way. You can drag words from the evidence pages to your notes of interest. This could help you with remembering certain pieces of information, or it can be used to transfer words to other pages other pages uh, you said Bob you said Bob Bob's not a character I don't know I guess I could always change it if I have to Okay. 
Don't know what I'm doing. Figuring this out as I go along. Ooh, cake. I want the cake. Give me the cake. The scrawny waiter was reading the newspaper when I came in. He jumped up when I approached him. Scrawny waiter. So, Bob. Thanks. Bob the waiter. Can he fix it? <laughs> Alright, so Bob is a waiter. Yeah! You have now unlocked Bob. This character will tell its tale when interacting with objects. You now have multiple narrator. Uh, use the mouse wheel to switch between them. Okay. So... Richard must have felt like some kind of spy, hiding such an important code in a custom-made crossword puzzle. Richard? Who's Richard? Okay. Richard. Richard! Alright, so let's save that. Let's go back and look at the clock. We took the first clock apart to build the secret lamp's mechanism, which is why the numbers match up the lamp's positioning. Now we have to hide this one. Kind of ironic. So the lamp match up the lamp's positioning. So you're looking at what, 11, 35? All right. I wonder if he has anything to say about this stuff. Why did Freddy not hide this? Richard told him to do so. Okay, who's Freddy? Isn't this Annabelle's hat? What was she doing out in the back? Probably William. <laughs> Alright, I've got too many names. How many characters can I have? Three, apparently. Okay. Um, I got a lot of info. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's go! Gotta find the lamp. Is this the secret lamp? Looks like a regular lamp to me! New. Lemon cake, strawberry cake, chocolate muffin. Heck yeah, man! Oh, can I have the cake? I want the cake! Worst game ever won't let me have the cake. I hear a rat. What a lovely painting of a cat. Okay, there's nothing in this room. Lamp! It was a close call right before that waiter caught me. Caught you doing what, you naughty? Annabelle's a freak. Put that out there. It was a close call right before that waiter caught me. Alright, Bob, what do you got to say about this? Ah, I forgot the combination again. Luckily, I always keep something around in the corner. Okay, so you got something hidden somewhere around in the corner, around in the corner. Oh, wait a second. 30, 3520, is that degrees? Is this a combination lock? Ah, I forgot the combination again. Luckily, I always keep something around in the corner. See, that's 45, so 30 would be like that. Ah, I forgot the combination Shut up! again. Luckily, I always keep something around in the corner. I don't hear anything. Alright, there's gotta be something else around here somewhere. 
The rat knows. Oh, okay. One, two, three. Pull. Okay, so... East, west, north. Right? Ah, I forgot the Shut up, Bob. Again. Luckily, East, I always keep something around in the corner. West, north. Ah, I forgot the combination again. Luckily, I always keep something around. Oh, I in the got corner. it. Yeah, I'm smart. Thanks, Bob. That's not a creepy noise at all. Freddie and William would play jazz when Richard wasn't there. He hates jazz. I can't believe my lie worked, and they showed me their speakeasy bar. The bar must be making good money from illegal booze if they can afford a radio. <laughs> Okay. Well, there's a buttload of money right here that I can't do nothing with. Was oh, this a cigar box? Broken bottle. Somebody needs to do some cleaning around here. Ew. Draw around the stool. Is there anything over here? An old phone? Though it doesn't seem to be fully connected. Perhaps it's just for show. Uh, perhaps you're just for show. Though I like that Richard trusts me with the code, I'm sick of looking for the newspaper every time I need it. Ah, I got a... Okay, so the newspaper has the code. Can I just look in here at the newspaper? Ah, oh, I have to go actually look at it. Isn't there a walk faster button? <laughs> it's okay. Richard must have felt like some kind of spy, hiding such an important code in a custom-made crossword puzzle. Ah, uh, I see it. I see it. Okay, six is first, four is sec why are why can't you just go normal? There we go. <laughs> okay, six, four, and three. Thanks, Bob. So kind of you. That's zero. Okay, six. Four. And three. Yay! What happened? Who's slurping in my... Oh. William was going to testify on the case? Now I understand why Richard was trying to cover up with my help. Can I zoom in? Oh, okay. Testimony. Hold on. Is it going to show it in actual words in here? Um, okay, I, I, William Smith, hereby declare that the man by the name of Freddie Baker wa was with me on the 16th of October. This means the official court testimony by Richard is false. I believe he is doing this to cover up his own crime. Okay, so Freddie is somebody that I should look at because... Uh, oh, there's a map. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, so let's keep oh let's see what what's your face. This testimony is written by hand. Why would it be hidden? Wait, is this related to the trial? No shit, it's a testimony. Oh. Okay. Let's keep going I'm not gonna go in there just yet let's see if there's anything up here Ooh, this table's been overturned looks like somebody 
had an argument. What's this? Ooh. It's the dark side of being an investigator. You always meet their corpse, but never hear the musician play. Tenor saxophone. I played the saxophone in high school. Actually, I played the alto in middle school, and then I played the baritone in high school. Plus one. What about Bob? Richard is thinking about selling the sax after the trial is over. Says he wants all reminders gone. Okay, so Freddy must have been a band member. Is there anything on here that I need to see? Whoa. That's cool. This looks really cool. Nope. Alright, cool. Nothing there. I never understood why Richard let them have a poster. He only liked the money they brought in. Man, you're a d you know that. There have been protests all over. The trial of Freddy is going to be oil on the fire. Oh, say no to unfair trials. Freddy will be unjustifiably persecuted. He will not stand for this. Okay. Oh, this is the back door to the alleyway. Okay, so let's go through. What was Freddy? So Richard must have been the owner of the bar club. Um, all right, so they were musicians. Oh, hold on a second. I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. Alright, so let's go to the beginning. Band members. I can't, I can't move that one. Okay, so Freddy's a band member. Because... It says that one of the band members is currently on trial for another crime, which is Freddy. Um, so I gotta figure out. Uh, I can't, I can't drag band members over. But I know who that. I know Freddy's a band band member. Maybe the saxophone was Freddy's. Okay, let's see. This is the stage. That's the only thing that I can find on the stage. Okay, so I'm gonna put saxophone in here. I'm gonna see if I can put saxophone in here with Freddy. Nope, that don't do nothing. So this has to be Freddy, but so there's got to be something else in here that can tell me what Freddy's job was. Because I can't figure it out. Okay, there's gotta be something else I'm missing. I wanna go back in the alleyway. Actually, I wanna pick this thing up. Okay. Um, let's go back over here. Gotta be something I'm missing. I can't get in here for some reason. It's okay. All right, maybe this will tell me. The scrawny waiter was reading the newspaper when I came Freddy in. Freddie Baker. He jumped up when I approached him. What am I missing? Richard must really trust me because he allows me to set the new code. Okay, that told me nothing. Gotta be something else out here that I'm not seeing. Yes, no, maybe.
I'm missing something. Why am I too stupid to figure it out? Is Freddy the bartender? Oh my gosh! I can't figure it out. Ah, oh, why am I stupid? I feel like I'm stupid. Wait a second. There's got to be a word in here that says musician, right? Musician. It's in here somewhere. It's got to be. Found it! Oh my gosh, sorry. That was painful. Freddy! You have now unlocked Freddy. This character will tell his tale when you're interacting with objects. You now have multiple narrator you use the mouse button to switch between them. Gotcha. Tap. Alright, Fred Word. Let's see what you gotta say about this stuff. When William used the phone, the boss threatened to break the saxophone. What's up with him and that old phone? I don't know. You tell me. William and I have good memories of this. We have been through so much. <sighs> Boss got so mad last time I tried to use the phone. He said it wasn't for people like me. That's not nice. If only I had known this. William is taking such a big risk. He doesn't understand how much danger he's in if the testimony was intercepted by Richard. Okay. So Richard did it. What did he do it with? I don't know. But I know it was Richard. Ever since the trial, I haven't been allowed to listen to music. What? Alright, so... Let's go to the first page. Oh, the first page. Uh, nope. Nope. This one. Okay. Name of the murderer. Richard. Okay. What time did the murder take place? Two o'clock. Hold on. Uh, this one. Two o'clock. Um, where's the note? Where's the note? This one? Yeah. Testimony. Right, let's go with testimony. Sack phone. Okay, let's keep going. I'm getting somewhere. I just gotta figure out what he killed him with. I bet you it was a saxophone. Damn. It's clunky at times. I have to walk around through the back entrance constantly. Okay, so he has problems getting through there. Uh, okay, so I got his name. Let's go to... Oh. What page is that on? Page 3. Okay, so Freddy has problems getting in the door. And it was 2 o'clock. And the testimony is the motive. Just gotta figure out what the murder. I have a feeling it was a saxophone, um, but I can't be certain yet. It's in game. Okay. Fuck! I wish you could just leave this shit behind me. Why is the clock broken? was working last time I saw it. Yeah, I don't know. And that does not say 2 o'clock. Whatever. I don't like playing in illegal bars. But they are the only places that will take in jobs. Did he come with a lock? Is that why it's broken? It looks like a fancy hat. Sadly, someone left it out in the rain. You're a fancy hat. What else do I have to look at? Bob thinks it's an honor that he gets to change the code. But he doesn't know it's just because Richard is too lazy to do it. And there's lots of broken stuff in here. But... Wait a second. When William used the phone, the boss threatened to break the saxophone. What's up with him and that old phone? 
What if he beat him with the saxophone? I have a feeling that's the saxophone. Um, okay, so... I have looked at everything with all these people, I believe. Fortunate new lack of pendulum is very recent invention. Stuck at two o'clock, seems shinier than everything else in the bar. Oh, he killed him with that! Because it's shinier than everything else, so he had to clean it. So it was the clock. It was the clock. Now we have to hide this one. Okay. Okay. I got it now. Murder weapon is the clock. Submit. Yeah! I'm the best. All right, that's it. Okay, I really enjoyed this. That was fun. Oh, it completely exits out. Well, anyway, I really enjoyed this game. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I hope the developer makes more and does more uh, mysteries and stuff. I'm going to try and find some more detective type games to play because that was a lot of fun. I like uh, thinking. Anyway. That does it for this uh, this video. Uh, if you liked it, leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you want more content like this. Maybe, please. <laughs> anyway, uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.